Rose. John. Who should we hang out with today? Us here on the couch. We saved a spot just for you, the listener. Hey, Spuddy, buddy. What's up, Spuddy? Hey, Spuddy. How you buddying around? I actually wasn't prepared for you to do the <laughs> you hanging out on this couch. I'm like, all right, you know what? Actually, yeah, thanks for yeah, hanging out. Yeah, Welcome to Couch Trades. Um, yeah, we need to figure out who we want to talk to. If you want to go to... Ki- I totally forgot that Kyoko was the room right next door. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, I mean, we could find out more about Sakura. Um... Fumi is chilling in the boys' bathroom. Yeah. That is strange, even for Hifumi. Um, let me see. Byakuya is probably still in the library. Yeah. Yes. I mean, Most I would, people are in the dorms. Yeah. If you want to, I mean, we could do Kyoko. Want to get you want to get to know Kyoko sure, a little? Sure. Let's get to know our um, monotone girl. Okay. Why not? Leave the area because her room is right next door. Just right here. And she's in it. I already checked on the map. I guess I should press the doorbell. What's the matter? Are you keeping an eye on me? Don't worry. I'm not going to kill anyone. That's a wonderful way to start a conversation, Kyoko. Yes. Oh. Hmm. Should I talk to Kyoko <laughs> for a while? Absolutely, let's get to know our murderer. I was just about to head to the dining hall to get something to drink. Did you want to come with me? Sure. We can be friends. What? Besties. Oh. I went to the dining hall and drank some tea with Kyoko. Fumi did not make this tea. I was okay with that. Kyoko and I grew a little closer today. Yes. What can I give her? Um... I don't think she cares about sea salt. No, I don't think so. I don't think she'll want the black croissant. Royal mm. curry? Nah, not feeling the royal curry. Mm. Love status ring. Ooh. Ooh. Hope's peak? Mm. God of War charm. G sick. Does she want to watch? No, I don't she, think so. She's not a watch kind of girl. Does she want a red scarf? Spice up that outfit? Ooh. She definitely wants Torneco's pants. <laughs> or the thong. <laughs> Don't think she's that kind of girl. How about Astro Boy doll? doll? Mm. Uh, Kirlian camera, which I can never say correctly. Adorable reactions. There are nothing but cat videos. What? That sounds like something she needs. It might be something she needs. I don't know if she wants it, though. <sighs> Tumbleweed? Does she need something dead? I don't, whoa. <laughs> How about the unending dandelion so she can find out who she really loves? True. Cherry blossom bouquet? Maybe. Self-destructing cassette? I don't think that's up her alley. Um, Hagen dancer? Eh. Kokeshi dynamo? Someone's graduation album? Nope. But she seems like she would want to read. True. Oblat? <laughs> <laughs> Water flute? Bojobo dolls? Maybe. She, if she's monotone. I know we, I'm basing off of the character we made with Kyoko. Yeah. She's but monotone, but like she might want a blessing. She might want a blessing. That might not she be a bad, a blessing. bad way to go about uh, it. Flashlight? No. But she could use it to investigate things. Uh, a I, man's I, fantasy. I, I truly doubt that one. School crest, despair bat. Uh, what do you think? What would be best for her out of what we have? What we have... Do we want to try the Bojo Bo dolls? Is that how you pronounce that? Bojo Bo dolls? Bojo Bo dolls. Or do you think she's a cherry blossom bouquet girl? I mean, I'd be down to give her something pretty. You want to give her something pretty? Yeah, she seems cool and like I really don't want her to kill me. True. So I think she's the one that could actually get away with it too. Probably. Like if she ever decides to be the blackened, she's going to get away with it. She's going to win. Yeah. Because she helped us so much with the, <laughs> with the first one. Mm-hmm. How did you know I was interested in this? Nice. You're an enigma, Makoto Nagi. <laughs> oh, Kyoko, talk dirty to me. Oh, seeing Kyoko so pleased with something I gave her makes me happy. Red, are you scared, Makoto? Huh? 
I wasn't. <laughs> Until right now. <laughs> Being trapped in a place like this. Who wouldn't be? Of course I'm scared being trapped in this insane school. Correct. Ah, that's good. That's good. So... Fear is proof that your imagination is functioning. Frankly, I feel bad for anyone who can't feel fear. Without imagination, you can never deduce which action to take next. But what about you? You seem totally calm. You don't act afraid at all. Wrong. I'm scared too. Of course. I simply hide my emotions. Oh my god, this is the greatest statement for her right now. There's no advantage to be gained from letting others see how you feel. You hide? Oh. Hey, Kyoko! I don't understand what you mean! What I mean is, I'm not as foolishly open as you are. <laughs> Damn! Whoa! Kyoko with the sick burn! Jesus! Foolishly open. Guys, our doorbell just oh, rang. Our doorbell just rang. a little rang. scared. We're just gonna let like, it go. Yeah. I don't care. I don't yeah. care. Also, the fear I experience is a little different from yours, I imagine. Oh, it's probably something that I ordered. I, oh, I have to go it. sign No, for it. I okay. know what it is. All right. Huh? What do you mean? You're afraid of what you might lose, right? But I'm afraid of what I've already lost. I'm sorry. I don't understand. I know. <laughs> <laughs> oh That's God. the perfect face with that, too. I know. <laughs> Goodbye. I know. And just, she didn't bother answering any further. <laughs> she just turned and... Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Kyoko, I, I truly love you. Always a pleasure. Always a pleasure, Always a Kyoko. Pleasure. With that, she was gone. Well, we're still just getting to know each other. Maybe we'll talk more next time. I don't think I understand her at all yet. Kyoko's report card has been... <laughs> what? Just... <laughs> Her report card, like the the fact that each character has a report card okay. with you. Kyoko's report card has been updated based on your experience with her. Your maximum number of skill points has increased. Hey, look at you go. Sweet. Once we were all done, I headed back to my room for a little while. It's nighttime. Okay, then. Do we have time for anyone else? Nope. Oh my god, I wasn't Monokuma at all last episode. No. Ahem. This is a school announcement. It is now 10 p.m. You know the rest. As such, it's officially nighttime. Soon the doors are dining hall o'clock. Blah, 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 blah. Wow. Wow. <laughs> John finally gets his chance to be Monokuma, and he's just like, nope. Okay, sweet dreams, everyone. <laughs> Good night, sleep tight, and don't let the bed bugs bite. <laughs> I mean, it's one of those things like, all right, he says it every night and every morning. I'm kind of like, all right. Another I, take on. But even though today is over, this game definitely isn't. And I can't reset. How long is this going to keep going? It keeps running, running, and running, running. <laughs> <laughs> all the stress and anxiety kept me from falling asleep until late in the night. When the lights... Go down in the city. So do you think this Monokuma theater is like a dream that Monokuma pushes out to like all users? I think so. Oh. <laughs> oh. That's true. oh. That's true. Bless you. Excuse me. Thank you. <clears throat> Whenever I spot a cute girl, I have a tendency to stare. I can't help it. I just gaze with intensity. The other day, I rode my bike to the train station. I was in the bathroom, just looking at myself in the mirror, just staring, going, you are not worthy. You are not worthy. Jeez. And then my anxiety flared up, and then I saw a cute girl, and I couldn't do anything. I just stared, and the only words that came out were, you're pretty. Good morning, everyone. It is now 7 a.m., and nighttime is officially over. Time to rise and shine. Dang, you didn't have to go that hard with it. <laughs> Get ready for another beautiful day. 
See, that one's fun to say. Well, yeah, it kind of is. Well, I guess I'd better head to the dining hall before anything else. Sure. Let's go. I will leave this area. Uh, I'm a go. So I think this whole, did we talk about this? Like this whole thing is in VR chat, like in the sense of the whole school. I think we might have mentioned I it. I think we might have mentioned it. I seriously, this might have been on our Discord then. Because so part of me really, really wants to just get a Monokuma uh, avatar oh, in yeah. VR chat and just run around as Monokuma <laughs> going, this bear, this bear, and just doing the cackle. I'm sure somebody does. I'm sure, I'm sure someone does. But, but I, might as well be another one. Exactly. I have mul multiple Monokumas running around. Yeah. I went to the breakfast meeting, same as always. But... Not everyone was there. Is this everyone? It feels a little small. Biakia and Toko had stormed off yesterday, and it wasn't too surprising they hadn't come today. Even the table looks bigger somehow. Well, there are now five spots that are empty on it. So, yeah. I assume it's because three people are dead and poo are abstaining. Celeste, thank you for being the voice of reason in all this. Yeah, with five people missing, I guess it would feel kind of empty. What's it gonna feel like? There's only three people left. When we move to another table, we'll I even be here. Oh, still. I know Biakia's whatever, but shouldn't we go check on Toko? Do you really want to, Hina? Uh, I vote no. She's super annoying. Jeez. How can you be so cold? You're like a piece of rock candy. What? No rock candy, or no, rock candy isn't cold, it's sweet. Anyway, Biakia's the real problem. If we don't keep an eye on him, he might really kill someone. You can see it in his eyes. Okay. We got no choice. Get some rope. We're going to have to keep him bound and gagged. Whoa there, Mondo. I think that's going a little overboard. He's right. In this situation, there's nothing scarier than when an ally turns loose cannon. It's just like when we were kids and someone would go crazy at sports day or whatever. What the fuck are you talking about? You're going to use a rope to do tug of war or something? Idiot. <laughs> I'm not an idiot. Oh. You're an idiot. Oh. Damn you. Who are you calling stupid? <laughs> huh? What's wrong? Chihiro, you don't look so great. Damn. Huh. Self-loathing. Well, after what Biakia said to me yesterday, I just got so nervous. I locked up. I couldn't say anything. All right. I retract my statement on saying Toko needs the hug. It really is Chihiro. Seriously? Chihiro needs the hug. Like, Chihiro, you're doing fine. You, it's fine. You are fantastic. We just love calm you. down. Mondo ended up having to help me out. God. I, I hate how weak I am. Oh, I see. So, Mondo made you depressed. <laughs> Hina! <laughs> Hina, you were here. And you just fell. What? How is this my fault? I was trying to be mean. Besides, girls are just naturally weak anyway, right? Ow. Uh, are you crying? It's because you were screaming like a lunatic. Hina, you want to you wanna back up there and <laughs> review what you said? 
I'm not gonna hiccup because I will actually. You get actually hiccups. start hiccuping, so I want to. Oh, come on! Don't cry! I did. It's my fault, okay? I won't yell at you anymore. <laughs> really? Not sure I can believe that. Just, just shut up! Got it. I'll make you a promise as a man. Maybe I mentioned this before, but ever since I was a kid, there was one thing my brother told me over and over again. He said that no matter what, a real man always keeps his promises. That's what he left me. Left you? Oh, yeah. Oh, my brother's dead. Oh, I see. Anyway, <laughs> I don't want to talk about it. Okay. Don't want to make you guys cry. Uh. Anyway, so you can trust me when I make that promise. You, so you don't get to cry anymore. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Mondo. Sure. But I still don't like how I am right now. I have to get stronger. If I'm so weak, anything can make me cry. Still, don't stress out too much about having to get stronger. No, I want to get stronger. Maybe I should start working out. In that case, I would be happy to help you anytime. What? Then, Miss Fujisaka. I was, I was like, I think yeah. I got this. Miss Fujisaka would get smashed into a billion pieces. Way to be positive, Hifumi. Shut up, you. Oh, finally cracked a smile, huh? Looks like Jahiro's gotten some life back. For the time being. Yeah, man. If we keep helping each other out like this, we're bound to get out of this crappy place sooner or later. I mean, someday, I'm sure. One of these years. Who knows when? Still, our biggest concern right now is the other two who never showed up to breakfast. What can I do to try and understand those two better? I don't I don't know if I want to spend time with them. <laughs> They're scary. Okay, so what should I do today? Isn't this a school? Shouldn't you be learning shit? Where are the teachers? Monokuma. Where are the teachers? I don't know. There are none. There are no teachers. Can't learn when there are no teachers. That's a valid, valid point. Do we really have to go hang out with both of them? I don't want to, and I don't even know if I have gifts for them. So let's get some more gifts. Oh my god, we should have done this between episodes. Oh, I know, could, I thought about that. We wouldn't have been able to. We could have. Well, no, we started no. a new day. Yeah, we started a new day, we wouldn't have been able to. So no, 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 we, we hung out with Kyoko right at the beginning. We could have gotten it then. I'm uh, sorry, that's guys. True. That's true. Um, I'll try and get through this as fast as I can. Um, sorry. Let's see. Let's guess what this is. A Switch. <laughs> a Nintendo Switch. What did we get this time? We got a capsule. A test tube? Yeah, that, what? We got a test tube. We got... A pen. pen. A fountain pen. Good for writing and nothing else. And boxing gloves? Slippers. slippers. They look like slippers. Shoes. Nuts. Coffee beans? These nuts. Wow. Could be. Yeah. What about those nuts? Those nuts. Oh, there's some boxing gloves. Oh, boxing gloves. Look at that. Uh, we got... Soap? Granite. Granite? <laughs> Just a block of rock. What the hell? <laughs> the 
dishes? Oh, that was a bento. Oh, was it? Okay. I think that was a bento. That is that straight is for Hifumi. Hifumi. That's straight Hifumi up. straight up. Oh. I don't think we can do much with the baseball. Yeah, I think the baseball. Uh, sorry, Leon. I think that's run its course. <laughs> sorry, Leon. You dead. Um. Him? <laughs> I don't even know. What's the shirt? one underneath? Oh, there's another oh, one of there's those. There's another one of those. The little doll. Uh, we got another oh, cassette. Okay. Cool. We got a black croissant. Now we're getting into we've gotten all these. I think it's almost time to just duck out. That's a. That's a keychain. Oh, lucky! Oh, ooh, ooh. I got lucky. And. Another baseball. What do you think? Good enough? Or should I keep going? Just burn them. <laughs> John's just like, we're not doing this again. Well, no, no, it's not even that. It's just <laughs> we're getting to a point where we're like, all right, we, we need some extra stuff cat just in case. Pin? Yeah, so that we can hang out with anybody. Yeah. I feel like the cat hairpin would have been either Junko or possibly Celeste. We got some chips. I feel like chips go to anyone. Maybe that's just personal bias. Yeah. A Concert ticket? <laughs> yeah, I don't know what that was. A, a phone. phone. A black phone. Black rotary a phone. Spare phone. Spare <laughs> phone. <laughs> Another scarf. Okay. Cool. And another little Hifumi statue. <laughs> I like how we both agree with you on that. We're just like, that's a Fumi statue. Yeah. An octopus? Lucky? What did I get? How am I lucky this time? <gasps> Another phone! I can call myself. <laughs> Put it at one side of the school and the other side. <laughs> Have to run back and forth. A Coke? Coke. Share a Coke. Share a Pepsi? I don't know. Another, Another pen. pen. Cool. Just a few more. Let's see this. Another, Another exploding tape. Self-destructing. The first spy mission. A Another. Bong. <laughs> it's a water flute. Oh, that's right. It was the water flute. I was like, <laughs> that's a bong. God of War thing. Yeah. Can spend more time with Sakura. We only give them the gift once. I don't know. I was thinking about that. Cologne. Perfume. Or perfume. No, Either one works. Yeah. And a phone. Jesus. Honestly, not bad. Or uh, how many? How high our repeat percentage was? Yeah. Um. But now, who do we want to hang out with? Let's see, we have the trio are still here. Yeah. Here. Should we just go to Byakuya and see? It's up oh, to you. Do we have something for him? I don't know. We opened up do you like- you want me to look first? Yeah, like 20 gifts. So let's see if we have anything that might work for him. Uh, Let's see, we have a Coca-Cola. Sea salt, would he want? No. Mm. Potato chips? Mm. Black croissant? Mm. Royal cure? It's royal. Royal curry, okay. Maybe? Maybe. Ration. Mm. So, okay. kind of a bento, not really. Sunflower oh, seeds. Oh, not even close. Not at all. Kitten hair clip. I could, you know, that would look so good on Viakia. <laughs> How about a love status ring? I'll bet he would love that. He, he might love that. Hope's Peak. Blueberry perfume. Okay. Very popular with men these days. God of War charm. Max gloves. Okay, that's kind of fun. Cheese Little stick. Mac. Yep. Uh, roller slippers. Oh, uh, they're like the roller shoes, yeah, but they're, they're slippers. slippers. Okay. Red scarf. Leaf covering. A loin cloth. <laughs> Meant to emphasize one's manliness. I'm sure that probably actually goes to Mondo. Oh, I'm sure. First song. Demon angel princess figure. Popular heroine. Yep. Astral boy doll. Um... Would Bianchi want a camera? Purple reactions. 
tumbleweed, dandelion, rose in vitro. It's a small rose stored in a test tube. It's good for both. Hellos and farewells. In the language of flowers, a red rose means passion. Cherry bo blossom bouquet, we don't have any more. Uh, Self-destructing cassette. Silent receiver. A phone that, for some unknown reason, doesn't let you hear the person on the other end and doesn't let them hear you. It's okay. almost like it's unplugged. Pretty hungry caterpillar. Not... Not a... Not Cthulhu. Yeah. Mr. Fastball. The Fun Plane. I think that's a Chihiro gif. Pagan Dancer, also Chihiro. Um, someone's graduation album. Would Would Byakuya like something like that? Get to know. Pumice. A pumice. Okay. Ah, volcano Rock. Oblats, Water Flute. Uh, ancient Tour Tickets. I was not wrong. Novelist Fountain Pen, so that would be... Celeste. Novelist Fountain Pen? Wouldn't that be, um, Toka? She's the writer. That's right. Yeah. That's right. I got that wrong. Chin drill. Okay. It equips a drill on your chin. I feel like that would be a Leon gift. A man's fantasy. Spare that. Okay. Do we have anything? For I mean, he might like, like, the pagan dancer. Or maybe you're right, the royal curry. I don't know if there's anything, like, truly loves. Yeah. So... If you want to hang out with him, yeah, it would be... I would say, let's do the Royal Curry or Pagan Dancer. Oh. It's up to you. Really? He wants the Pagan Dancer? Possibly. Maybe? Maybe. Okay. Um, sure. Let's uh, go to the library. Spend some time with our best bud. Yakia. He loves spending time with people. Bud. He seems to be really focused on that book. Really? Now's not a good time to talk to him. Okay. My bad, dog. Um, um, should we spend time with Toko? Sure. I gotta, she's probably hiding in her room. Yep. There's Toko. Yay. I guess I should press the doorbell. Leave me alone. You don't have to pay attention to me. Mm, should I hang out with Toko for a while? Well, with a greeting like that, who can refuse? Oh my god. Would she like the pen? Yeah, she'd probably like the pen. Oh god. Just do whatever you want. But don't come in my room. I spent some time with Toko. God knows why. I think she hates me more now. Toko and I grew a little closer today. Let's give Toko... Oh, God. She had her evil laugh. God. Oh, where's this pin? I have two of these pins. Maybe she'll take both of them. Did you pass it? I don't think so. What if she'd like the rose in vitro too? Oh, she, she probably maybe? would. Use it for some kind of uh, writing thing. There it is. Ah, there it is. Uh, that's... Sorry. Wait, what? But I'm already engaged to master. So I can't go on a date with you. If you're okay with that, I don't mind if you think about me. Wait, what? Seeing Toko so pleased with something I gave her makes me happy. Wait, what? <laughs> Who is Master Toko? Friend. Friend. She's just standing there. Does she want something? Friend. But she's not saying anything. Um, maybe I should try to start a conversation oh with this antisocial god. person that I just spent the morning with. Oh my god. Um, Toko! What? You wanna talk to me? Well, I can't stop you, so talk already! 
Okay, sure, but what should I say? So, uh, <laughs> what do you like to do in your spare time? Why do you want to know? Well, I mean, you know, we're trapped here together, right? So if we're going to be friends, it'd be nice to get to know each other. Huh? What'd you just say? Uh, help, 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 help. I made a mistake. I talked to her. I talked to her. After that part about being trapped, we're going to be what? Uh... Friends, don't you use that nasty language with me! She slaps you. Oh. <laughs> what do you mean, friends? You think I'm stupid? You are trying to trick me! I've already been hurt once before. Aww. I'm not gonna let it happen again! You've been hurt? What happened? Anyway. Come on. You don't really care about me. You don't want to know about me. Even I know that. No, that's not true. Fine. Then tell me. Tell you what? You know why they call me the ultimate writing prodigy? Right? I just gave you a pen. <laughs> yeah, sure. You've won all kinds of literature prizes and stuff. Then tell me what I'm good at. Tell me what my genre specialty is. Isn't it like romance novels? No, it's a ro I, I think it's romance novels. If you really want to convince me you give a crap... You should at least know that! The genre that the ultimate writing prodigy, prodigy specializes in. Nonfiction, romance, or young adult. Because I think we tried to get close to Chihiro. No, uh, to Toko when we were on stream. Mm -hmm. And I think that I was completely surprised that it was actually romance. But if you'll double check that for me. That doesn't really matter. It's romance. Romance? Yeah, I remember being... I, okay. Like, the little things I do remember, it, it's romance. I was also trying to get you to stall for me so I could take a drink. You could just say, hey, I gotta take a drink. Stall for me. I'm like, hello, my baby. Hello, my darling. Hello, my ragtime gal. You know what? That's on me for sitting here and opening my bottle and holding it to my mouth as if I wanted to drink and expecting you to pick up on the context clues. <laughs> Clearly, I'm the asshole here. <laughs> <laughs> At least you know. <laughs> I feel so loved. <laughs> it's romance, of course. Oh, you actually knew? Your biggest success was So Lingers the Ocean, right? Everyone says it's your masterpiece. The book was such a hit that fishermen shot to That's, the remember they said that at the beginning of the game too yeah yeah and i remember that too fishermen shot to the top of the of all the hottest men pools right how did you know all that there's no way you care about me i'm telling you i do i mean we're friends aren't we makoto's superpower is just being friends with anybody exactly he's he's like a golden retriever <laughs> Yes. He's just like, he's friends with everyone. He doesn't care if anybody hurts him. He's just like, I'm going to be friends. I'm going to be positive. Mm, I'm, I'm blind. Your straightforward nature blinded me. <laughs> Toko ran off screaming like a banshee. I'm not really sure. Does she hate me now? 
Toko's report card has been updated based on your experience with her. You just unlocked the skill vocabulary. Give yourself a pat on the back. You've earned it. Okay, thanks. I got words. Once we were all done, I headed back to my room for a little while. Should we try Byakya again? Mm, it's up to you. I'm assuming we have more free time. Still time left in the day. Maybe I'll go explore. Maybe I can talk to people. Right, we can go hang out with uh, Byakya or we can do... Because I kind of want to hang out with someone that we haven't yet so that we can see if we can unlock a skill. Yeah. Which uh, some of these we got to hang out multiple times to unlock a skill. Well, I think the first time is you unlock it and then the second time you level it up. Okay. Not always. Not always. Because I, I, we didn't unlock anything with um, Sakura. True. Um. I mean, pretty much whomever you want to hang out with. Let's see. Do God, we dare or, spend time with Hifumi in the want, bathroom? I mean, that's weird, but I'm pretty sure the little doll thing that we got is... Oh, we have so much for Hifumi. 100% Hifumi's thing. At least we know, right? Oh, God. Have you experienced it? The sweltering heat of the summer cons. The frigid cold of the winter cons. It's my duty to create a product that will satisfy the brave fans who suffer for their passion. I don't have time to be cooped up in a place like this. Hmm. With words like that, should I hang out with Hifumi for a while? You know what? Sure. Let's spend some time. You want to hear what I have to say, huh? I mean, no, but yes. Well, what would you like to talk about? Comics, video games, anime, collectible figures, take your pick. Ifumi, you are the reason that nerds got a bad name for a long time. Damn! <laughs> I listen, listen to Ifumi's half-obsessed ranting for longer than I would have liked in this smelly bathroom. Smells like ass. Hifumi and I grew a little closer today. Oh, sure. Do I want to give him nothing, but... Let's see this. I think it's more towards the bottom. What about a man's fantasy? Absolutely not. <laughs> um... Where is it? I thought it was towards the bottom. I guess not. <laughs> That's on me. Wait. Who does want this? I don't know. Here we go. Would he also want the astral baby doll? It would seem like it's up to Sally, but I think we're better shot at the demon oh, angel. 100%. Yeah. Oh, I hit the wrong button. I, I never imagined you'd give me a, something so rare, Mr. Nyagi. Super, god damn it! Uh, super greater than three. God level greater than less th than three. Oh shit, less than three. Yeah, that is less than. God level less than three. Result less than three. Seeing Hifumi so pleased with something I gave him makes me happy. <laughs> I see quality in you, Mr. Nyagi. True quality. <sighs> And that is why I've decided to present you with my lecture on the nature of fan fiction. Everyone buckle the hell up. I think I have to do this. If we're going to be friends, you must be fully informed. I will permit no fanfic bigotry whatsoever. I don't think I have any fanfic bigotry. I mean... I don't really know what bigotry is, and I don't know anything about the, that kind of geeky stuff anyway, because I'm a golden retriever, and I don't deal with bigotry. See, there it is. To you, fanfic equals geeky, right? But it is all the word. That is all word of mouth. Wait, what? Sorry. That is all the word is, is worth. But is that all word is worth? 
Is that all? That word is worth it. Okay, yeah. 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 Huh? Did I say something wrong? Well, there's such a thing called San Diego Comic Con. Huh? It's fantastic. I mean, it seems to be. Because I take the word geek as a compliment. Oh. Yes, uh, for you. For you see. For you see, there is nobody on earth so fully of knowledge as a geek. Full of knowledge as a geek. I mean, kind of. In a sense, a geek is an expert. That's right, a total expert. A successful musician must necessarily be a music geek. A good movie director is a movie geek, you see. It's those experts, those geeks, who open up the world to others. So, when you say the, that writing fanfic is geeky, you are recognizing us as true experts. Okay. So, um, what exactly is fanfic then? Oh, super direct question, FTW. Yep. Basically, we have all different kinds of stories and events, right? These are the these are where groups of holy warriors <laughs> sell their own stuff based on games, comics, anime, everything. Okay, I'm following you. And these people, and the stuff those people make, is fanfic. Comics are the most common creation, but it's also but it also includes games, music, and even merchandise. By the way, there is a name for a group of fanfic creators. A uh, what? There is a name when a group of fanfic creators come together. A convention. Specifically, it is organized. It's an, any organized group that comes together to release their work. A group that comes together to release their work. Square, a menagerie, or a circle? I feel I like... I honestly don't know. I feel like it would be menagerie, but I... That's... I'm thinking either menagerie or circle. But this one is... Uh, it might be circle, but goddamn menagerie... Because a menagerie was originally a place to like show off oddities so maybe or like menageries were like the forerunners of zoos like they were made to keep animals that were not from that area but i mean it's a circle of friends though yeah that's what i'm thinking oh sorry i thought you were still focused on the menagerie. yeah circle circle <laughs> wait what I was explaining what menagerie was originally because that's what you were going with. Um, yeah. So a circle? Let's go a circle. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Is it a circle? It sure is. Of course you knew that. I mean, it's only common sense. It's the best shape. I certainly hope you don't expect me to explain such common sense topics every time. Just kidding, best shape is hexagonal. Well, like I said, I don't know much about this stuff. This goes well beyond I don't know too much. But I guess I can't blame you. The propaganda never touches on that. So as a fanfic ambassador, by the time I'm done with you, you'll be itching to buy a premium pass to the next fanfic con. Right. Obviously, he's excited, but... <laughs> That's it for today. I hope you're excited for your next lesson. I can't wait to see the future, what the future has in store for you, the two of us. Yay! I'm kind of scared to see what the future has in store for the two of us. <laughs> oh, you God. good? Yeah, I'm good. Hifumi's report card has been updated based on your experience with him. <coughs> you just unlocked the skill handiwork. <laughs> Give yourself a pat on the back. You've earned it. Because of course Hifumi did anything to deal with hands. Yes, he did. Oh. <sighs> 
After we were done, I decided to head back to my room. For nighttime. I can only do two things a day. Fred, I guess I'm feeling a little hungry. I better get something to eat before it's nighttime. I should head to the dining hall then, I guess. Because I have to talk to myself constantly. Or something like that. Oh, God. I'm scared about what or who is in the dining hall. We're just going to get some chocolate milk. Sure. Some chalky milk. Chucky milk. Chucky milky. I just wanted to get something to eat. And now I'm ab about to get roped into something like this. Actually, no. I guess I'm already roped in. Oh, God. Hey, Makoto. Perfect timing. Yay. Huh? What's going on? I have a favor to ask. A favor. I have a bad feeling about this. Oh, God. <sighs> let's just, let, let's start here. Why not? Come on, Makoto. You gotta be our witness. Okay. Witness to what? This guy's been talking shit about me since day one. Calling me a coward and shit like that. Jeez. You are a coward. That's why you turn to violence to solve your problems. Good God, Taka. That's why you can't do what society asks of you. Why you walk around dressed like that. <laughs> What's wrong with the way? Yes. The friend you say? You don't know shit. I mean, not wrong. You've already lost to yourself, but you're such a coward, you don't even realize it. <laughs> so what? So you're saying you're not a coward? You think you're tougher than me? I know I am. Okay, then let's throw down. Get on the dance floor. Prove what you got. Prove you got what I don't got. Everybody do the dinosaur. I accept your challenge. Dance off. So that's what's happening, Makoto! You gotta be our witness! You're gonna throw down. You're not gonna, like, start punching each other, are you? In the bathroom on the first floor of the dorm, right? Bathhouse. A bathhouse, yeah. Different than a bathroom. Yes. <laughs> With a sauna inside? I see. I see. A simple endurance contest, is it? We're going to see who can stay in the sauna the longest. Am I right? Good damn straight. Good job, guys. Why not? Are you guys really going to go through with this? Shit, yeah. He'll be done in a matter of minutes anyway. People like him are, without exception, all talk. You wanna throw down Bring it. On! Hell, let's make things interesting. Wouldn't want to win without a challenge, right? Interesting. Son of a bitch. We're going to battle with all our clothes on. That, that's idiotic. Suicidal. You want to what? You afraid? Says the dude who's like, <laughs> let's just all hang out with the wang out. All right. This is one of the strangest battles that I've ever seen. You, I mean, yes. You, you, you're going to regret this. Shut up and let's do this. Kick your pants on. Oh, God. Oh God. <laughs> the towel on the hair. Uh, oh, all right. <laughs> also, I thought Taco was keeping his clothes on. I thought he was. I thought everyone. Yeah. Uh, hey. Mondo! What, asshole? You can take off your uniform, you know. Go ahead. I won't judge. And you can shut the front up and mind your own business. I mean, look at you. Oh, my God. Your face is all red. Uh, what your... What are you? What are you? What are those goddamn hot springs monkeys? It just so happens I was born with a red face. Those eyes, man. You don't have to act on big man! As you say. Ha 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 ha! 
I'm still pretty good to go. I'm so good, I could eat a steaming hot bowl of soup right now. Okay. Sure. Are they okay? I tried to push my concern aside. A few minutes passed. Then a few dozen more. Then an hour. Then I was tired. And I went to bed. <laughs> uh, don't you think it's about time you gave up? What are you talking about? You can't even handle... Oh, you can hardly talk, dumbass! Say, wh what, what do you want? I am still totally good to go. In fact, I'm starting to feel kind of cool. That's... Pretty good! Hey, uh, guys, I know you both want to prove how big of badasses you are, but don't you think you've done enough? Shut up! Gah, I just can't win. How is he hearing that? I mean, there's speakers all over the school. But there's no monitor. I don't, know. I don't know. Ahem. This is a school announcement. It is now 10 p.m. As such, it's officially nighttime. Soon the doors to the dining hall will be locked, and entry at that point is strictly prohibited. Okay then, sweet dreams, everyone. Good night, sleep tight, and don't let the bed bugs bite. Hey, did you hear that? It's nighttime! How about we call it a tie? In true competition, there is no such thing as a tie. You win or you lose. That's the only thing that matters. Listen to you, you son of a bitch. Then bring it on. I'll, I'll push you right up to the gates of hell. Damn, Mondo. That's pretty intense, dude. The gates of hell? That's not a good place to push someone. <laughs> It'd be a little toasty in there. Poor Mikoto. This isn't good, guys. Yeah, you want to hear him? Better crawl on. Are you here? Better crawl on back to your room. I'll let you know how it went in the morning. Then you can stop spreading. Start. Start spreading my my legend. Come tomorrow morning. You'll fall down in front of me, down on your knees. I'll show you where to Ooh, do it. Oh, there, Taka. Oh. Big talk from someone whose face is about to explode. Oh, God. Right. Back at you. Red. Okay. Well, good night then. I really hope those two don't overdo it. But I'm sure... To the death? No. Surely they wouldn't go that far. Fred. Surely not. The concern stayed with me as I slowly succumbed to sleep. Those two are crazy. Yes. We probably should have spent time with them to find out how crazy they That's were. That's true. If fate does exist, does that mean your future is decided the moment you're born? Maybe. If all your yesterdays pile up to create your tomorrow, is your future as final as your past? I just don't know. Nobody does. That's why I'm still alive, because I don't know. That's why I desperately cling to life. But you're a robot. Are you really alive? I'm not a robot. I'm Monokuma! Clearly. That's my bad. Sorry. Sorry. Good, Good morning, everyone. It is now 7 a.m. and nighttime is officially over. Time to rise and shine. Get ready for another beautiful day. Morning. Huh? I hope Mondo and Taka survived worried about the two of them I hurried to the dining hall more quickly than usual because why not start at the dining hall instead of the sauna yeah, to see, see if they if both still died in there. and when I entered 
<laughs> what are you talking about, bro? Ooh, that was weird. Not good. <laughs> what are you talking about, bro? What the? Hey, Makoto! Thank you so much for acting as our witness yesterday. Huh? Are they friends now? They've been like this all morning. They were all buddy-buddy as soon as they walked in. It feels gross. Patrice and Patricia actually agree for a change. It's gross. Almost as bad as br as bab sweat. It's just bad. Feels gross? Hell no. Feels great. More like. This almost feels like sexual harassment somehow. Forget her, bro. A girl like her just doesn't get our manly bond. Is it just me or do Yutaka's arms just seem a little short when he does that? It, it, yeah. Just checking. Friendship between men is stronger than blood. A woman can never understand. Wow, okay, I said that. Wow, Taka. Ain't that right? What you just said? Bro, that was cool as shit. I gotta get a tattoo of it. Don't, it's dumb. <laughs> no, bro, you mustn't. Your body is a temple given to you by your loving parents. So, uh, who won the contest? Who gives a shit? Yeah, don't ask stupid questions. What matters is that we're, we both took part of it together, in it together. That's completely different from what you were saying last night. Friendship between men seems very simplistic. Nothing like that <laughs> I'm used to with girls. <laughs> yeah, for realsies. All throughout breakfast that morning, the room was dominated by Mondo and Taka's overpowering brotherhood. One of them is gonna die. One of them is going to die. All in all, it was a pretty unfortunate experience. Either that or both of them will die just to get them to shut up. Who knows? Who knows? Who knows? It's hard to say. So, what should I do today? Oh, hello. Ding dong? Hmm, who could that be? Wondering who had, who had come to visit, I opened the door and someone forced their way in. Is it a girl? <gasps> it's a girl! Oh my god. I mean, it's not the girl I wanted, but it's a girl. Toko, what's the matter? Why are you so surprised? Am I really that annoying? Well, I already know I'm annoying. I came here knowing that. So that makes it okay. No, you're not annoying. I just wondered what was going on. I have a favor to ask. I want you to go somewhere with me. She keeps on getting quieter. <laughs> and where is it you want to go? I'm sorry, what was that? Library. Huh? Are you looking for a book or something? Why don't you just ask Byakia? He spends all his time in the library. Anyway. Did I say something wrong? You're not a blabber mouth, right? This has to be a Secret. I honestly have no idea what you're talking about, but if you want me to be quiet, I'll be quiet. Then let's go to the library. Jeez, why so pushy? <laughs> I got nothing. Are we, are we going? We're, are we doing well, this I mean, next I th time? I think we're stuck, aren't we? I
Oh. Is this a nice cliffhanger? This might be a nice cliffhanger. That's kind of what I'm thinking. Oh, thank you. Let, let's so, right. uh, come back next time, guys, and we'll find out why Toko wants to go to the library. See you later. Bye. <laughs>just subscribe just do it just do it right now subscribe watch other videos and subscribe we'll go I, back to our weird faces i think the other videos are up here maybe right there